What's up dudes and dudettes? I had a couple of auditions this weekend and I learned something this weekend that I hadn't even thought of before and it's, it's one of those things where you, you, you learn and you go, why didn't I think of that before? Do you know what I mean? Like, I feel like with any industry, especially this one, the moment you feel like you've learned all there is to learn is the moment you start to regress. There has to be some willingness to to admit that you don't know everything in order to continue to improve. I think it's necessary with anything in life, really. Uh, you know, there, when once you become so arrogant to the point where you think that you know everything and can't possibly improve, you're you're going to start regressing. You're going to start forgetting things and developing bad habits. And every so often, you just need to reevaluate and you know figure out if there's a different way to move forward. I know there's some people on here that uh, are actually actors that, you know, are looking for tips. I know there's also people on here who follow me for all my other things, things that I've been on and so forth. And that's fine. You know, maybe you guys will enjoy it too, but this is more so for actors. There's little tips I've learned along the way that helps my booking percentage. And some of those things are like when I'm submitting an audition, I always upload my reel. There was a time when I didn't have a reel. And honestly, it's better to have no reel than it is to have a bad one. Uh, there are people who make their own reels by doing uh, auditions or uploading previous auditions and stuff like that. And it's really not a great thing to do uh, because if it was that good of an audition, you would have booked it and then you would have had reel footage, you know? Uh, so I don't advise that, but at any rate, you would think that you wouldn't have to upload your reel because it's on your profile and actor's access, but believe it or not, that tends to help. The other thing I learned uh, tonight was uh, my friend who was helping me read the audition for me suggested, I put it out, I've done this exact same type of role before on a very popular TV show. And she was like, you should upload that clip even if it's in your reel, write in the notes that you've done this type of role before and that you're including the clip so they don't have to hunt for it in your reel or say it's the first thing in your reel or something like that. And I was like, why have I not thought of that before? Like, of course, you know, if uh, I, I got a buddy who plays a lot of cops on TV shows, he's just, he, he looks like a cop and he plays a bunch of cops. Uh, and I have to imagine he probably has like a cop reel, you know, and just like, here's all the times I've played a cop kind of thing. <laughs> and I, I, I know some people would look at that as being typecast, but honestly, I don't think you could be typecast at this level, if that makes sense. I'm not famous enough yet where they're like, you know, Adam always plays these guys. I, I do tend to be, for some reason, I'm known as the guy that like screams at kids a lot. And, you know, I'm aware that I look a little insurrectiony, so like he can be our, our, our you know, he's he's that rednecky looking dude, even though he's not, but you know, he, he can be that guy. I get that and that's fine. You know, I'm happy to play those types of roles and stuff, but honestly, I, I've, I just want to work, you know? And if that means that I'm always doing those kinds of roles, I'm fine with that. I feel like uh, some cool stuff will get sprinkled in and then they'll start to, you know, they'll start to be more familiar with my range and then that'll broaden. But we'll see. It's, uh, you know, it's a marathon. It's not a race. So that's, that's the goal. I, I, I don't know why I didn't think before, like, put in a clip of you playing this exact same character before and then... You know, like, of course it's going to help. Why wouldn't that help? How did I not think about that before? So, yeah, hopefully that helps some of you guys. Um, and, yeah. Anywho. Uh, update on me. I'm doing well, I feel like. I've, uh, you know, I'm getting some auditions. I've got some bookings. Got to go uh, film in the coming weeks. And I'm excited about it. So, at any rate. Uh, love you dudes. Uh, click the like button, subscribe, all that bullshit, and uh, I'll catch you guys next time. Love it.